uh, I, I almost want to say, I want to say I'm losing you because that's like full on tear my heart out, rock concert, blues singing, or I'll get to scream at my pains and tolls of this country as a civil rights torn, torn place. Uh, I get to scream into the audience what that pain is, but it's also it's so hard. It's so, so difficult. But, uh, it's satisfying to push myself to the limit like that, you know what I mean, every night. So I, I guess I got to say that one. Otherwise, I'd have to say, uh, I wish it would rain. Because this is another time I get to kind of do that, but I can start this from a soft place because we're all so broken in this moment. This moment in the show where we find out that Martin Luther King has been killed. I found out that my girlfriend is just, uh, well, Tammy Terrell, was his, his love of his life had died at 24 from a brain aneurysm, which he might have caused. Um, so his life is destroyed in this moment. It's a moment of hopelessness. Uh, and it's such a beautiful song. The man that wrote that song, his name is slipping my mind right now, actually killed himself after he wrote it. Like, it's a heart-wrenching song. So in a way, it's, it's therapeutic because I get to go through even my own life, my own pains, and uh, kind of do some healing there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's tears pouring out of you. You're sweating. You're on the ground. That yeah. moment is highly emotional for the audience as well. Good to hear. Um, so congratulations on that because I <laughs> felt some type of way after that. I was like, damn. <laughs> Good. Good. But like, I needed to cry. Should I go listen to that song and just cry it out? You sort of... You That's get that the release most on amazing stage. thing sometimes. I did the show just last week. It was a Sunday, and there's an older black man sitting in the audience, like maybe two rows, center right in front of me in that moment. And, you know, especially older men, our, our, our older black men, we don't go to therapy. You don't do all that kind of stuff. You go to church and pray about it. You tough up. You be strong. That's what the song is about. And I saw this man just, like, weak and start to crack. And I, it floored me because men like him probably didn't get a chance to cry because they were told that it's not manly to do so. So we carry, again, we carry around so much baggage and so much like fake strength. We have to sort of as survival techniques that, uh, that I think this show sometimes helps to us to release uh, and myself included. So it's beautiful to watch somebody like yourself, somebody like my grandfather out there, my dad even uh, be forced to deal with it finally. Mm -hmm. 